Good afternoon and welcome. I'm Jason Bennett. We're live from Witten Oval. We've been looking forward to this contest between North Melbourne and Port Adelaide. Things can turn around quickly in footy and both these sides will have reinforced that during the week. Today, crucial for both of them. Now it's time for the players to take to the field. Kelly Underwood is alongside me. Hello, Cal. What can we expect from this one? Good to be here, Jason. I've tipped the power. I just feel their pressure game and their forward half efficiency will get it done for them today, but it should be a cracking game. Fair enough, Kelly. Thanks for that. The toss of the coin is about to take place. We've been looking forward to this one all week and now the moment has arrived. McGrath wins the first hit out. Gavalis. She's run into trouble. Squeezes the kick. Done. Gathers in the centre square. Is anyone home? Punched away. Ewings. Goes for goal. Flirts with the post. She's a terrific asset with her pace and skills. And that was another example. The power have wasted no time getting on the scoreboard. Punched clear. Ewings normally delivers. The Ruse have won it back. She's under close attention. No one able to clear the footy, so we'll have another ball up. Who can get the clearance? Ewings takes on the responsibility, just needs to finish, and finish she does. She's got two, and she looks in the mood to tear this one apart. The power with a bright start. McGrath showing her skills. Bruton closed her down. King running in support. What she got on offer. Hammond tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Cockatoo Motlap does well under pressure. Carney went bang. Inside 50 with the kick. Here's a big chance to peg back the margin. I wouldn't put this past her. I've seen her do it before. She should have the distance, but I'm not sure she has. Punched away. Taking no chances there. Back into play. Quality delivery by foot. Searching kick. Hardeman got a fist in. Brown. That's skillful. Carney. Going for her first. Cockatoo Motlap belts it clear. Rushed over and they can reset. Taho heads to the pocket. Have they weathered the storm? The power have started well. Thumped away. You can never question her commitment. That's an uncharacteristic mistake. A good kick here and they'll be in business. The great Spud Frawley would have loved that one. Comes free in the tackle. Must be holding the ball. It is. McGrath. She might have thought about the corridor. Right. Clears the area. Hardeman is cool under pressure. Thought her way through it. Carney. Doesn't often waste it. Unable to get it inside 50. Can she find a teammate? No one can mark. And out it goes. Daniel Harford is down on the boundary. Half, what have you got for us? Clearances are pretty even at the moment. If one side can get on top there, it'll make the job that much easier. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. Bruton, terrific tackle. King looks set for a big one. That's not a mark. Probing ball. Well played. 
If she can nail this first shot at goal, she might just be in for a big day. Drop punt and she has put it away. She managed to find some space in a dangerous position and made them pay for their loose checking. Great contest so far. Rennie with the tap. Bruton, it's a tough game. Foley mops that one up. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Gets her kick despite the heat. McGrath. Carney gets back and should repel. She's set upon. Fantastic tackling technique there. Rennie wins it. This is great pressure footy. King. Sweeping handball. Well done. Lays it off. Riddell throws it on the boot. Hammond went bang. Foley. No easy exit. Clever kick. King belts it clear. Mules. She's drawn a crowd. They've bottled it up. Great ruck work. Bruton. Can anyone take a mark? She's normally better than that. King needs help. Brown. Desperate defence. Wall. A good tackle. It's a goal. They'll feel better now they're in front and getting some reward on the scoreboard. The Roos have hit back hard. McGrath wins it out of the centre. Maloney, she's wrapped up. Ewings, done. She's been busy so far. Houghton appreciates that delivery. This would give her a shot of confidence. Looks good off the boot. She's got it. She had the opportunity to put them in front and that's exactly what she's done. Lovely finish. So the underdog throwing down the gauntlet. You can feel their belief growing. McGrath wins it. Maloney feeling the heat. Yorston, Mules. Here's the vital kick inside the 50. Houghton working hard and being rewarded. The power looks sharp early. Punched away. Bresnahan. And they're out of trouble. Leaves it behind. Hardeman. She's so clean with the footy. That's well played. Riddell. King can run and gun. Can she hit a target? O'Day went bang. Yorston. She just dropped it. The power on the ball now. Foley. Good build up. That didn't travel far enough. Up and under. Houghton. Towards the boundary line. Mules. Kicks laterally. Defense 101 there. Riddell. She's made a hot start to this game. Rennie. Strong grab. They're moving the football quickly. King had her name written all over it. Great play. The power have been caught napping. The Ruse with a late chance. That looks online. It is online. They've hit the front. She might just be in for a big day. Goal for goal. Good close match unfolding. Levicki palmed it down beautifully. Maloney knew the tackle was coming. Houghton might be just outside her range. This is what she gets paid to do. Kick these goals. Struck it well. No problems there. Honours the lead. They'll be in front in a moment. She's got it. Neither team is able to string goals together or generate any meaningful momentum. It's an engrossing battle. The power edging their way back in front as we near quarter time. Matza wins the hit out. Bruton, the defenders will be nervous. Wall got to the right position and hung on. Into the pocket she goes. To give them the lead, she's done it. If they keep moving the ball quickly, there'll be plenty more where that came from.
Both sides have struggled to generate momentum so far. Levicki palmed it down beautifully. Ewings, Yorston, what can she do with it? One quarter down, it's been entertaining so far and there's little in it on the scoreboard. Now for some analysis from half. The Power won plenty of the ball in that first quarter. In fact, they're leading the clearance count, but they undid some of their good work with sloppy disposal. If they can combine both elements, they'll be very confident they can win this game. Good on your half, thank you. Levicki palmed it down beautifully. Bruton leading from the front. Mules into the action again already. They've worked it well. Ferguson belts it clear. Hardeman, she's so good in close. Bresnahan, a chance to clear now. She's kicked it high. No one can mark. And out of play. Down at ground level, half. The Power are doing a lot right, and they've got great belief they can win this match. The longer they stay close, the more that belief will grow. Levicki gets her hand to it. Maloney, she's besieged. Tahoe, Yorston, they could be in front in a minute. Good disciplined defence. Houghton. Bad kicking there, out on the fall. What can they generate? The kick is precise. The Power, guarding the corridor. Riddell. Heads towards half forward. No one can mark. And we'll have a throw in. Lots to analyse, Daniel. What stands out? Football's a game of mistakes, and both sides are making plenty. The key is where you make them and what the damage is. Levicki with a deft tap. Maloney, she stopped in her tracks. Yorston, she's run into trouble. Ewings, an ill directed hand pass. She doesn't waste many. Done. Belts it clear. The power might be behind on the scoreboard, but they're giving a very good account of themselves. Levicki slaps it out. Maloney, Yorston, they cannot keep her quiet. Ewings. She just keeps racking up disposals. Look at her go. Navigated the traffic. Yorston, under pressure. She's everywhere at the moment. Ferguson with the big fist. Houghton, it's a goal. They move that ball very well indeed. They're hard to defend at their skillful best. Only four points separating the sides. Levicki has had her measure today. Bruton met solidly. Garner. Brown had it and lost it. Cockatoo Motlap runs onto it. Good thinking and good execution too. As Dennis would say, that kick was centimetre perfect. No one can mark. Hardeman hunting the footy. King has found some space. Kicks to half forward. Eddie marks. Will she go the bomb? Hand pass cut off. O'Day. Her field kicking is normally first rate. Tickle. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. Mules. Tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. Thumped away. And they see it out. The power. We're expected to give a good account of themselves today. But they're every chance of winning this. Matza showing her skills. Ewings. Mules. That's not like her. Bruton takes the hand pass. They'll be sore in the morning. Garner sets a task for the forwards. Who's front and centre? Dunn puts her head over it. Terrific forward pressure. Syme. Good looking kick. King. Couldn't quite. She ran into a brick wall. Right. Wins a hard ball. It's a goal. It's a gift, really and she has taken full advantage. The Roos have the edge, but they're in a scrap. Don't worry about that. Levicki palmed it down beautifully. Bruton, solid tackle. Can she impose herself on the match? Time for the Crummers to go to work. Hardeman, she's generally a good kick. Matza is hard to beat one-on-one. -on -one. Ignoring the corridor for now, Riddell. Picking their way through. This is great ball movement. 
She hasn't kicked it very well. Luck's a fortune. It'll be a goal anyway. These half chances can often be the difference. Snap around the body. It's there. A classic case of a four finishing off the good work upfield. Both sides are cracking in hard right now. It's a great contest. McGrath palmed it down beautifully. Bruton, terrific tackle. Riddell, she's set upon. Garner in the right spot. Wall will bail her teammate out. It's so important to be efficient in front of goal, particularly when it's tight on the scoreboard. She's got it. It's always good for the confidence to see that first shot go through. It's a handy buffer they've established. McGrath wins the tap. Maloney, Ewings. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? Yorston, Tahoe, in some space now. Looking to pull one back. That's exactly what she's done. Well played. She buzzes around the forward line, always on the move and always happy to have a shot at goal. Away we go once more. McGrath gets her hand to it. Maloney needs a good decision. Mules. This is promising. No one can mark. Heads goalward and she's off target. Well, that was a promising build-up and deserved a better finish. Brown to bring it in. Bresnahan presents in space. It's one for the high flyers. No one can mark. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. The Roos are losing the clearances, but they're still in front on the scoreboard. If they can start winning more clearances, look out. McGrath with the tap. Ewings, Mules, towards half forward with the kick. Sloppy disposal keeps letting them down. Wall. The power have denied them the corridor. Riddell. They've worked it well. How's the entry? Punched away. Matza. Bends it around the body. That's on target and through it goes. If they can get up ahead of steam, they'll be hard to stop. That was a terrific passage of play, culminating in a great goal. The Ruse with a bit of breathing space now. Rennie wins it out of the centre. Riddell. The kick was ill-directed. Can they keep the footy this time? Ewings. Can she be the fire starter? Quality delivery by foot. Tahoe. For a second goal today. Not quite. She's missed. A fine passage of play, but didn't get the finish it deserved. Back into play. Bresnahan all on her own. They're playing with purpose and composure. Carney on centre wing has marked. The ruse look well drilled. They've opened them up here. Bit of a nothing kick. Eddie. I don't think she meant to smother it. She'll certainly feel that one. They've had the better of the contest to this point. Strong grab. Takes a beauty. Can she deliver? You back her more often than not. Shoots for goal. How's the kick? No good. Miss one she should have got and let them off the hook. Foley heads wide with the kick in. Hammond marks in the back pocket and they're away. Levicki. They'll contest in the centre square. No one can mark. Gavalis. The ruse. Playing like winners. A good tackle there forced her into that mistake. Goes long. Gavalis went bang. Wall. She's got an option in the centre square. Rennie. You can see their confidence growing. Looking for some quick ball movement. Gavalis. Good kick. Carney. Heads towards the half forward flank. King. Out of the congestion. She's lost possession. We've hit the long break and it's a handy margin, but by no means a match winning one. This game's very much in the balance. What's happening down there, half? The Roos are a slightly better team, I think, and the scoreboard reflects that. But at the same time, they haven't been able to get this fully on their terms, and I'd expect they'll be forced to fight all the way for the points. Their best should be good enough, though. Good on you, half. Thank you.
McGrath wins it. Maloney, Ewings. She's drawn a crowd. They're going nowhere and we'll have a stoppage near the centre. Rucks go at it. Riddell, the Ruse, are playing some great footy. They've given it back. I've liked her game today. McGrath. That's a good option and this looks promising. Who's at home? Second effort needed. Phillips, an ever-present threat. She's got it. Better ball movement on that occasion allowed them to open up that opportunity in front of goal and they got full reward for it. The power on the board first after half-time. Important clearance here. Ewings, Yorston, she's caught. They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded there. It was a fine tackle. Rennie palmed it down beautifully. Riddell copped some unwanted attention. Phillips. Greg Williams would have been proud of that one. Cockatoo Motlap can run and carry. DeMello is the target and she marks. This to get it back to a point. That's offline, never really gave it a chance. Well, you can't afford to dwell on it. Just got to make sure you get the next one. Brown tasked with the kick in. Gavalis pushes into space and receives the footy. She got under that one. Dowrick belts it clear. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Wall gets the kick away. Brown runs onto it and can drive them into attack. She's done brilliantly. Hammond had the presence of mind to get to the dangerous spot. They'll bide their time. King wins it back. Great mark. Not good off the boot. Brown had her name written all over it. Forwards dream of these shots. Bangs it through. She's finally on the score sheet. She's been quiet today, but gee, she made that one count. The Ruse with a steadying goal. McGrath wins the hit out. Maloney, Yorston. She'll be sore tomorrow. Dowrick. It's a hot footy. Cockatoo Motlap. Crunching tackle. Tahoe. It's hard to defend ball movement like this. Straight in front. Should not miss. She converts and narrows the margin. That's what happens when you leave players in space inside 50. It hurts you on the scoreboard. Neither side giving an inch. What a contest we're seeing. Bruton, they're a big chance here. Punched away. King, set sail for goal, but the kick is astray. One behind only. Tahoe brings it back in. Oh, that's a contender for mark of the round. She has not managed to find the middle yet. She should do so here. It's not the best kick. Has she done enough? Accuracy in front of goal is so important, particularly in a close game. Tahoe tasked with the kick in. Foley has charged into space. The power might be able to start something. Riddell, desperate to win it back. King appreciates that delivery. She kicked this more often than not. Goes at goal, but I think that's going the wrong side of the post. It is. It's a behind. They're missing some opportunities, and it could really come back to bite. Foley with the footy. Have they weathered the storm? Good thinking and good execution too. The ruse forcing them out wide. As Dennis would say, that kick was centimetre perfect. Their coach is going to lose it in a minute. Carney. The defence has fallen down. Riddell can go back and shoot at goal. Kicking at her first. Set sail for home and delivers. Some good ball movement there created that opportunity and a cool finish as well. The Ruse are holding them at bay. Rennie wins the hit out. King, terrific tackle. 
Can they turn back the tide? No one can mark. Houghton, the defence is disorganised. Cockatoo Motlap. There's an argument for a free kick there. Great ruck work. Riddell, dangerous place to lose it. Hardiman collects the half volley. On the spot to lay the tackle. And we'll have another ball up. McGrath smashes it out of there. Maloney, she ran into a brick wall. The umpire will have it. McGrath with a deft tap. They're playing for keeps right now. Carney looking for two in a row. Punched away. Sermon. It's a high kick, a real rainmaker. Right, belts it clear. Delivers to centre half forward. Foley belts it clear. Dowrick, Maloney. What a game she's having. Done. Heads for the pocket. Well played. She hasn't looked like missing so far, so I'll back her in here. Heads towards goal and does not let them down. Four goals without a miss. No wonder they're looking for her when they go forward. The Ruse in front by nine points. McGrath wins the tap. Dowrick, can she get it out? There goes the kick inside the 50. No one can mark. Bresnahan, they'll be sore in the morning. Right, doesn't want to turn it over there. She stopped in her tracks. Half what's caught your eye. The power aren't getting much value out of their clearance dominance, and that could be very deflating. Punched clear. Riddell, King. Delivers it inside 50. Thumped away. Keeps it low. It's a desperate tackle. Ball up. The defenders will need to be on guard here. Rennie with the tap. Carney. It's a tough game. Riddell. How will the umpire see this? Umpire says she had no prior. Rennie wins the tap. Oh, good tackle. Got to get it going forward now. Quality delivery by foot. I'm not sure she's got the journey from there. She's normally dependable, and she is this time. That's a great reward for work ethic. She deserved that goal. The Ruse are keeping them at arm's length. Rennie has rucked tirelessly. Carney, solid tackle. Bad error there. She's set upon. Dowrick, she's gone. Maloney, couldn't get an effective disposal. She's under close attention. Drives it inside the forward 50. Punched away. King, she can sense a goal from a long way off, but the kick is astray. She's got two goals, three now, playing beautifully, but she could have had an even bigger impact. Foley brings it back in. Hammond, working hard and presenting well. Can they get something going? Done. will turn for home with this match firmly in the balance. A cracking final quarter coming up. It's time for some observations from Daniel Harford. The Power are close enough to believe they can pull this out of the fire. They've been second best for three quarters, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything now. One very good quarter of football, and this match can yet be theirs. Expect them to keep coming, whatever happens. I'm inclined to agree. Thanks, Half. Rennie showing her skills. King on the same page as her ruck. Riddell fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. They want ball there, but they're not going to get it. McGrath wins it down. Carney, she's going for home. And why wouldn't she with a finish like that? The Ruse going from strength to strength. They've got all the answers at the minute. It's a comfortable margin, but they wouldn't want to take their foot off the pedal. McGrath punches it out of the ruck. Carney, that's a bruising tackle. Towards full forward. Cockatoo Motlap wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. No one can mark. Wall, they're well drilled. Smith 
She's run into trouble. King. She couldn't get rid of it. They wanted holding the ball, but nothing doing. Rennie, the winner there. She's already got one. Now she's got two. They might want to tighten up on her. They gave her too much space on that occasion, and she made the most of it. The Roos have got away. Rennie wins it down. Carney drives it inside the forward 50. Gee, they're playing well. King. This will be another one. They can do no wrong. They're really opening them up, and right now they have no answers to the onslaught. We thought this one might be close, but it hasn't turned out that way. McG wins it down. Maloney met solidly. Darrick, got to get rid of it. Yorston, good use of hands. Levicki liked it off the boot. That's going close. A real opportunist goal there. She doesn't need a lot of the footy to make an impact. They've got one back. Let's see if they can double up. McGrath wins it out of the centre. Maloney, Yorston, displaying great endeavour. Right. She'll certainly feel that one. They appeal for a free kick, but will have a stoppage. McGrath gets her hand to it. Carney, King. Normally delivers. That's a bit of a gift. The power. Haven't thrown the towel in. Sermon. Marks. Will she go the bomb? This might be a chance for the high flyers. Bresnahan with a terrific mark deep in defence. Out wide with the kick. Yorston gets a good bounce. Down at ground level, half. The Roos are giving their forwards better supply and those forwards are making it count on the scoreboard. Rennie gets her hand to it. Bruton. Carney. Kicks to centre wing. Who will stand under that? Foley went bang. She's drawn a crowd. Squeezes the kick. This spells trouble. King. What a game she's having. She's drilled her fourth. The Roos looking every bit a top eight side at the moment. The power. Need a miracle now. Rucks go at it. King. So influential today. Garner. Bruton. Carney. Heads towards goal, but the kick is astray. Minor score. She's clearly had a big impact on this match, but that impact could have been even greater. Taho brings it back in. Hammond has found some space. Done. Working hard and being rewarded. What she got on offer? Hardiman got a fist in. What are your thoughts, Daniel? The Roos will take a lot of belief out of this, not only because of the win, but the way they've gone about it. They've put plans in place and executed them. She'll be sore tomorrow. Ewings, she's hit up the lead. Maloney, under the gun. That won't make the distance. Ferguson, taking no chances. Rushed over and they can reset. Hardiman to bring it back in. The kick is precise. She might have thought about the corridor. That's well played. The Roos can smell blood. Gavalis. Handball was good. They've got winners all over the park. Bruton. Their ball movement has been impressive. Matza. They can smell victory. They've opened them up here. Smith. Doesn't often waste it. Honours the lead. Bruton. It's a hot footy. King. Takes on the responsibility. Just needs to finish. And finish she does. They've smashed the 100, and there's still time for more. The Roos, in this form, would challenge anyone. Levicki gets her hand to it. King, she's besieged. Dunn wins it back. That'll be play on. Not a lot of positives today. Hardiman, crunching tackle. Houghton with half a chance. She's got it. She's certainly one who can hold her head up high. She's been terrific. The power with a much needed goal. Levicki got her palm to it. Closed her down. Ewings knew the tackle was coming and will do it all again. Matza got her palm to it. Bruton, Garner. Some people can't kick that far. King only knows one way. In towards goal. She's made the goal umpire work. An ugly looking scoreboard should probably be looking even uglier. 
Taho to bring it in. Foley marks in the back pocket. It's hard to find a winner for them today. Strong grab. Takes a beauty. Searching kick. Bresnahan belts it clear and out it goes. Lots to analyse, Daniel. What stands out? The Roos are putting the opposition's defenders under all sorts of pressure and the Fords are making it count on the scoreboard. Yorston looking to peg one back. It's come unstuck. That's good vision. Bresnahan all on her own. That might attract a pack. King dishes it off. Right. This is promising. Stripped of it. They've put themselves under pressure. Tahoe. Can she find a teammate? Thumped away. Throws it on the boot. Foley claims a terrific contested mark at centre half back. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Hardeman takes an excellent grab. Probing ball. Smith can keep it moving. Delivers it inside 50. She's plucked it and she should have a shot. The Roos are working harder at the present time and they're reaping the rewards. Drop punt and she has put it away. The power are in real danger of taking a big percentage hit now. The four points have been gone for a while, but this is hurting their percentage too. McGrath, the winner there. She's wrapped up. Yorston kicks inside the forward 50. Ferguson tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Desperate defence. Going at her first, and she's got it. The power have done well to stabilise, but at some point they need to apply some scoreboard pressure. That goal hinted at what might have been. Carney, it's no place for the faint-hearted. Can she hit a target? Punched away. Brown with an opportunity. The power, a chasing tail. Eddie King. It's there. The defenders are entitled to be annoyed with their mids. They're under all kinds of pressure. A really nice percentage boost coming up here. Rennie gets her hand to it. Carney, King, drives it inside the forward 50. Sermon had the presence of mind to get to the dangerous spot. Clever kick. That's a good option, and this looks promising. Maybe not the best option. The Roos come away with the win. Too strong, too tough, and too good. That's all for today. Hope you enjoyed the action. It's bye for now. Let's sing it one and all.